Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. You know what, I'm saying? what is your weakness where the business is concerned? Whoa, let's expose him. The weakness? Yes, your weakness. Everybody has a flaw. Everybody has a weakness. You have your strength and you have your weakness. Well, what is your weakness? Um, where you know that your strength is, you're accountable. Yeah, I had um, my, my weakness was trusting. Wow. And um, I got into it. It was an act that I was there. In Inglewood, give you a hint of what I'm talking about without saying his name, in Inglewood, when he was with a group, I was working with the group, grew up around the dudes, everything. Then he started working with Ice Cube. I'm working with Ice Cube, so I'm with him every day. Ice Cube just interviewed me and him in the back, sitting around talking, doing wow. whatever, right? And so then he did this thing, I did a single, I played bass all over it, right? Whole album. And then, um, he got kind of big, then he started signing groups from Inglewood. So he used to have me produce them and stuff like that. He's cutting me checks. But then I beat, I did a song for his album, and he, he forgot to pay that one. Wow. Mm. Then he was playing games. Call me tomorrow. Call me tomorrow. Page me this time. Page I know who it is. Just by the he way just you kept doing, He kept voice. doing it, kept doing it, kept doing it. And I was like, hey, homie, you know what I'm saying? So then, uh, uh, yeah, it, just, it got real bad. Then the album came out. And he ain't knowing that he got people that want to take him out. Wow. Mm -hmm. And they're getting at me, they think they know him. And they almost threatened my life or want to pay me a whole bunch of money. I thought about it, so I'm sitting there <laughs> contemplating it. I mean, my, uh, my manager's office is a white guy named uh, Evan Forrester, so I, but he knows everybody, Evan does. So I'm sitting there contemplating, he said, but what, what you doing? And he knows the people that are after Mac-10, he knows they're serious <laughs> people, I ain't gonna say their name. Mm -hmm. Should goes to them when he has a problem. Wow. Oh, wow. So that dude got at me, and I'm like, I was thinking, oh, I can use that money. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they don't know. Because what's wrong? I was thinking about it, I'm, but I'm sweating. I'm like, like this, man. Because what's, what's going on? I said, man, I got a decision I got to make, man. And I told him the situation. He said, no, man, that's not how you do it, dog. You're, you're grown. You got to leave that street shit alone. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. He said, this is how you do it. He called Priority Records, knew the president. Called him, said, hey, you got a song out there without a contract or a check. Or wow. What am I, what am I whatever. And we can do a cease and assist right now. Exactly. Unless we get paid. And so he called the artist. The artist said, I'll be there in a half an hour with the check. <laughs> they faxed the contract and told me to be up there in a half an hour to have everything. I showed up, signed my check, signed the contract, and got up out of there. Shout out to Evan. I just never did, Shout never out. did business yeah, with Yeah, Evan say, say like, because I know out to Evan. My, da my dad's an attorney. Of course. And so I know that accomplices do jail time too. Right. So they're like, how'd you find this house? You know what I'm saying? He told me, boom. He. There I go, you know what I'm saying? I get locked up too, so I, right. I avoid it. I mean, it's a lot of street stuff out there, so. Man. I can imagine, especially Trusting. when you're raised around that. It's yeah. so easy to just get that done. But you'll yeah. think, we cool. Me and you cool, we hang out. I see you about a month or two, I'm gonna work with this show, you blow up all that. Hey, hey Payback, I need this theme song for my show. Oh, all right, cool, cool. I'm usually gotta do like a dope deal. Where the money at? You know what I'm saying? You got, I see the money, okay, here's a track, the switch. You know what I'm saying? So I'm thinking, you the homie here, man. You know what I'm saying? Okay, I'll, I'll pay you tomorrow. All right, pay me tomorrow. And then I don't hear from you. And then you're playing games on the phone. Oh, call me at 1 o'clock. And then you don't answer. Call me tomorrow. I pay you in 30 minutes. You know what I'm saying? After a while, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a fool. You know what I'm saying? So, so that, that was, but that was a learning lesson. And I just, I just, everybody, when I do business, I don't care if it's my mama, my brother, anybody, what? You know what I'm saying? You want to do something? All right, here's the contract and the contract and the check. Yeah. All on move. I don't care who you are. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.